his new head of state security. His name, Lao Hu, is Mandarin for tiger. Not worried about tigers. I brought a wolf. Brent Foster has been with the show since last season. His role has expanded just by virtue of the fact that he's kind of running around with me as my security detail. This has been a bit of a, a roller coaster ride for Wolf this season. He's out for blood. Well, Wolf's goals for the season are basically to support the continuing effort to get the cure out to the world and try to move forward with his life and revenge against Pang, the Chinese leader. Go! He finds himself in situations where he selflessly puts himself forward in order to keep his crew and his friends safe. We meet a worthy adversary. We'll find someone who actually gives him a bit of a challenge. They meet and they lock eyes. It's an amazing acrobatic exchange between our two martial arts experts. His opponent, the MSS agent, is predominantly a kung fu stylist, but with Wolf, You'll see him change from, he, he might start out in a tie clinch doing some Muay Thai, moving to some throat strikes, some eye gouges, to Salat, some high kicks, spinning kicks from Taekwondo, some power punches from Karate. The soldier that Wolf is, if you look a little bit deeper into the choreography, you'll see that seamless integration of those different styles. It tells you where Wolf has been, where he's studied, where he's trained in the martial arts. And Wolf absorbs what he needs in his toolbox. When it comes to, say, highly trained military guys, highly trained martial arts guys, they'll see it and they'll go, whoa, well, they'll know what's the, what they're looking at. This is another level. That was good. You okay? That was great. Yeah, that was great. One of the pirates, Alizan, Ron Baliki, is one of the best martial artists in the world. He comes from a direct lineage of uh, Bruce Lee, and his wife is actually Bruce Lee's goddaughter. His father-in-law is Dan Inosato, who was instrumental in developing Jeet Kune Do with Bruce Lee, and actually taught Bruce Lee Filipino martial arts. So you will see a machete fight that it's, to me personally, I think it's off the charts. The moves, the technique, and the caliber, and the speed we were going, we used real machetes. It was weighted steel machetes, and we went for it. <laughs> There is nothing to this level that has been done on TV. The Last Ship, all new Sundays at 9 on TNT, and watch anytime on demand.